I'm Sign Chatterjee, and I present to you Team Skylock. And today we have prepared a presentation regarding our airlock design. Now our airlock is unique in that we use four doors instead of two doors found in normal airlocks. Now the first door will be used for spacewalks. This Two other doors located on the side will be used for docking spacecrafts, and the last door will be docked up to the spacecraft itself. Hi, I'm Bianca, and I'll be discussing the power budget for our airlock. We are currently about at about 600 watts, which include the power output of our sensors, such as the temperature sensors, our pressure sensors, and any other miscellaneous electrical components that power our airlock. All right, and the materials we use for our airlock, we decided that um, complex magnesium alloys backed up by a steel infrastructure would be you know, the best materials we could use for the airlock just because uh, they're lightweight and very structurally sound so that the airlock itself will have no weaknesses to let air you know, leak out. So that being said, we decided to go with a very simple corkscrew design and basically we figured that this was a good way of storing air pressure so that's what we went with. And basically, how the corkscrew, corkscrew design you know, goes into the main body of the airlock is that basically there's a long pole with a gear connected to it, and that is connected to another gear, which is then spun around by another motor. And then basically, that motor spins the airlock, and a second, you know, a second similar in concept hydraulic motor brings the entire thing down, and they're all time synced so that when you turn it on, it goes down, it'll lock in automatically, and the same goes for when you turn it back on.